So you might be connected socially with your plus one on social media. So you're connected with your plus one on Instagram or Facebook, but are you connected with them on LinkedIn? While preparing for this episode, I checked when my wife and I uh, connected on LinkedIn, right? So I checked the history and we connected in 2014. By then, we already had our two kids. And that got me thinking about connecting on Facebook and, and Instagram and, and social media uh, with your plus one or a close uh, partner. And when or if you do that on LinkedIn and why, and why is, is there usually such, such a delay? Topics of like this about how digital transcends into relationship are great, of great interest to me. For example, at what level in your relationship do you share passwords with your plus one? For example, access to your phone. That's a big one, whether it's pen, thing, fingerprints, biometrics, whatever it is. Do you give access to your phone? When, even if you have nothing to hide, and I know a lot of people are uncomfortable, including me, uncomfortable doing that. Would you and why? What, what does that say about you? What does that say about the relationship? What does it say about the importance of a digital device? What about Netflix, Netflix passwords? I come across frequently breakups of public on social media that says, we broke up and by the time I got home, the Netflix password was changed. That also has to do with the health of the relationship and the importance of a digital asset like a Netflix password. What about Facebook and Instagram passwords? So that means access to your private messages on Instagram and Facebook. How far do you go when in that relationship? That's on the private side between you and the partner. What about publicly? Are you Facebook official? That was an important term uh, early on in social media. Uh, to give you an example, I used to be in discussions with others who are telling me about the relationship and how excited they are, how things are going and so on. And, and they're going so well and they're going to many places and they think that there's something solid in that relationship. I ask him basic questions. Are you Facebook official? And usually, I, so that means that you put your relationship publicly, both of you on social media. And that's, I get either silence or a mumbled answer or a long discussion about uh, yes and no and why, but yes and no, just why they, they don't have like a self-justification of why they're not Facebook official yet. I wish you healthy relationships where the digital part of it includes a contribution to your relationship, like sessions on Netflix, where you watch jointly content that helps contribute to time spent together and not unnecessary social pressure.